Well, hi everybody and thanks for joining us here for a Storm Team 10 weather update. Well, we had some rain during the uh, course of the day on Tuesday, but now as we get into the nighttime hours, the rain is moving out. So the rain will be ending if you're having any lingering showers and then even some late night clearing is possible. So here's Wednesday at 9 a.m. I, I believe we'll still have the possibility of some clouds during the day on Wednesday, especially the first part of the day uh, because we've had some rain and some cooler air is coming in. So I, I believe we'll have some clouds possible. So we'll, we'll call it partly cloudy, but then we get into Wednesday night and the sky clears and then it's going to get cold. An overnight low Wednesday night could get down to, well, the mid 30s, around 35 degrees or so. And now the next few days after that don't look too bad. I think the bigger story perhaps is the fact that after this rain, it's going to stay dry again for a while. So rain ending and a chilly north breeze, 41 for the overnight low, and then 57 uh, becoming mostly sunny tomorrow, especially in the afternoon. A chilly northwest breeze could be up to 13 miles per hour. That'll send a shiver through you, I think. And then clear and cold tomorrow night, the breeze becomes light, 35 degrees for the low, and the seven-day forecast dry for most of the forecast period until maybe about Tuesday of next week. Then we may have to talk about the possibility of some showers, but overnight lows are going to get pretty cold, especially this weekend as they hover around the lower 30s. Weather updates always available at WTHITV.com.